day for me. Vlogmas. Yeah, let's get it. Oh, that was great. Oh, please, please. I'm just driving downtown today. I really had a taste for some cheesecake from a cheesecake factory. They got this wrap and artichoke dip type thing at the Cheesecake Factory's appetizer. I really had a taste for it. This is Michigan Avenue that we just rolled down. That's the water tower right there. Ooh, they gotta run that light, gotta run that light. So this building right here is the John Hancock building. I'll get out and show you how big it is. If I used to work there, I'm just gonna park right here and put on my flashers. Please don't tell me. I'm literally coming right back. Like they will literally tell your shit. Oh, I have to hurry. So this is the John Hancock building. I think Oprah used to own like the top floor. But anywho, I used to work up there and I used to go down to the bottom floor um, and get Cheesecake Factory for lunch sometimes. That's a nice treat. So here's the Cheesecake Factory on Michigan Avenue. Let me put on my mask. Okay. Oh, perfect. Oh, that's me, Kina T. Thank you. Okay, so I am power walking back to my vehicle simply because I'm not supposed to be parked where I'm parked. Therefore, I can get told, don't tell me, don't tell me. Yes, I'm good. The car is still there. But this area is really one of the like richer parts of downtown Chicago. And this is like the higher end. When we go back up Michigan, I'll kind of show you. Now we're heading to the South Loop, which is still technically downtown. It's like a more chiller area. Don't get me wrong, everything downtown is expensive. This area right here is like the most expensive part. This area is called the Gold Coast. And we're gonna go back up Michigan so you can kind of see some more stuff up Michigan. It's really nice. And then we're gonna head to the South Loop, so you're gonna see like the difference. Burberry store, Grand Lux Cafe. Uh, Michael Jordan Steakhouse is not too far from here. It's like right up the street. When I did work here, I didn't like the job that I was working, obviously, but I loved walking up and down Michigan Avenue every single day. It was just so inspiring to see. I am now crossing the bridge, leaving the Gold Coast. People can't drive downhill. Like, if you can't drive, bro, man, don't come downhill. Like, this is not the place for people who just got their permit, bro. Like, if you not from here, don't be, oh, they the bean, y'all. That's the bean that y'all tourists like. Woo, bean, go girl, hey, you can. Hey, y'all, now we are entering the South Loop. So this is more of a residential area. You have more black-owned establishments in the South Loop, like black-owned restaurants, black-owned stores, urban upscale feel. More of a soulful feel to it. It's not all black though, it's definitely gentrified, especially now. Oh, this is still Michigan Avenue, but it's not the Mag Mile, like the tourist area. Yeah, these are all apartment buildings, condos. If I were to move down here, I would live in this area. I like the South Loop a lot, it's a lot more chill, a lot less congested. It does give you the downtown feel, and it is still upscale, but it doesn't give you that over congested touristy feel. This is the L right here. The L is shortened for elevated train, I think. And these also do run underground, so this is like our subway system. Oh, here comes one. color coordinated so that this line right here is the green line it goes to specific parts of the city but yeah it's just like our subway system this is also a black owned shop right here this is the lotus stand it is a black owned crystal shop let's go in it really quick can i film for my youtube channel i'm just like doing a day in my life today and i really wanted to show them this black owned crystal shop this is the owner right here isn't she fabulous guys hey guys She's great guys. I just, I'm gonna brag about her because I love her already. You're so sweet. 
Well, if you are watching her, that means you guys are resonating at a powerful level. Ooh. So I'm sending out major love and light to you all. Talk yes. about it. On the right page. So we're favorite thing in her house for huge rose cord. She has oracle cards. Yes, her name's Kelly. She owns that crystal shop right there. Like I was telling you guys, like it's like a lot of cool stuff down in the South Loop for real, for real, especially for black creatives like myself. And if you didn't know, I own a business as well online right now, but it is a holistic healing business and I make crystal jewelry, necklaces, pendants, anklets, bracelets, body chains, and I make aromatherapy candles, natural lip oils. But I'm back now. I had to help my little cousin with his homework, so I just wanted to try to see downtown area. Look who's home. I'm just trying to find myself Sometimes I feel alone like I'm by myself I even ask why myself But can't forget that I'm still blessed